everyone and welcome to the Game Shed with me, Mark. I'm back on Green Man Gaming and it's time for another mystery bundle. This time it's time, I said time a lot of times, time for the five pack mystery bundle. Now, the difference with the five pack. First of all, it's £5.99, so six squids, six of your favourite pounds, your big monies. Uh, over the 3 99 four quid of uh, the three pack. So, if you've watched the three pack video, you would have seen I didn't get a great set of games. Um, so, I've got real high hopes, even though they're always low when it comes to these mystery bundles. Real high hopes of the five pack. So, let's have a quick looky. Are you feeling lucky? Get five fantastic titles. Right, so the difference with the two bundles first of all, the price. Second of all, in the $3.99 bundle, you get a mixture of Origin, Play Fire, other types of keys. In this bundle, you only get Steam keys. Right, so get five fantastic titles in our new mystery bundle. Buy now to uncover the secret Steam keys within. Are you feeling lucky, punk? Well, are ya? Right, so let's go back to my orders and go to games. And this time, it's under Steam Games. Ignore these two. I've already claimed them, so don't bother trying to nick those. These are the five we're looking at. These are the five. So, first of all, the first game is called Zack Zero. What the hell is Zack Zero? Never heard of it. Very intrigued. Okay, it is a $6.99 PC download. Right. Da, da, da. It is a Steam game. I wonder if... God, my page is loading very slowly. Right, okay. So this is a game with a retro-ish look, bearing both the style and flavour of those lifelong horizontal scrolling arcade adventures. So basically it's a 2D scrolling, 2D slash 3D scrolling, fighting and shooting and all that kind of lovely stuff type game. Uh, does that develop Zack up to level 20? Follow the storyline. Real-time online ranking system. I don't care about any of this because all I want to read is the reviews. Daniel Zoo says old school shooter. So just, so now just go and get it, he says. So you have to listen to him. Daniel knows what he's talking about. Oh, Master R gives it 67. Uh, I have to quit and restart at a checkpoint because I got stuck. Oh, he was so angry. But overall, it's a polished experience of a side-scroll game. Why'd you give it 67 then? Hey, Master R. The other reviews are pretty good. 80, 75, 81. So I think this is actually a half-decent game by the looks of things. So I'm going to claim that one, I think. Um, yeah, Zack Zero. Nice. That's game number one. Let's check out game number two. Game number two. Look at this. Dark Souls 2. Scholar. Dark Souls 2 Scholar. Uh, let's have a look in here and see what we've got. I do know the Dark Souls games and they are very, very good. So Dark Souls 2 Scholar of the First Sin. Holy moly! Look at the price. Look at the price. Right, so this is on Green Man Gaming. That is the price they are charging for this awesome game. Um, I need to play a Dark Souls game. I've never actually played one. So look at this. £30 worth of game in a £10 bundle. 38.8 thousand players. Oh, I'm very happy with that. Wow. Gamers are in for a big surprise in Dark Souls. An unforgettable journey awaits. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Let's check out the ratings. 77, 75, 85, 90. Wow, Nub Nubs. Nub Nubs is loving this. All in all, a better game, better than DS1 in my book, and hopefully DS3 will be as good, if not better. Wow! DX Sam 9057XD gave this 96%. 96%! An amazing game, redone with a new gloss and some changed placements makes it so much better. Hmm. If you want to get into the Souls games, this is a good place to start. I think he's over-egged it with the 96. His... His uh, reaction to the game in text sounds pretty boring, if you ask me. But he did give it 96, so I'm very impressed. Alright, so it's 30 quid on here. Um, everyone's always asking us, go on G2A and check out the price. So, alright, I understand that G2A is cheaper. 
So I'm going to have a quick look in here and see whether this game is in here. Oh, here we go. Oh, so you can get this game for £13.29. Right, remember one thing with G2A. 1329 actually straight away equals 1461 right so bear that in mind that's with the g2a shield if you take that off all right we get 1329 but there will still be some charges i think we're talking about a pound on something of this price so you are looking at what's this pay by phone anyway you would be looking at about 14 pound so that's 14 pound and the pack cost me six pound so work that one out so for once I've actually got a decent game can you believe it Dark Souls 2 hello scholar of the first sin moving on let's get to game number three so we've done alright so far uh, the next game is bridge constructor I have seen this game before and I've wanted to play it so this is a bonus for me let's see how much this normally costs PC download £6.99. Right, so if we go and buy uh, G2A prices, it's probably about £2. So I'm still doing alright. I'm doing alright. So for those of you that don't know this game, you build a bridge, you send your cars over it, and you see what happens. See what madness happens. Look at this. So uh, there used to be a, a mobile game that was very similar. Total players 37,000. Check out the reviews. There is none. None at all. So let me know if you like this game, if it's worth me playing. Um, otherwise, I don't know. I'll see. I'll probably play it anyway. Right, so on to game number... What did I get to? Four, I think. One, two, three. Yes, four. Tidalis. 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 What the heck is this? Right, it's a £3.99 game. And it's a puzzle game. You always get a puzzle game in these bundles, no matter what happens. I don't know why. It's a block-based puzzle game with casual appeal. So for all of those of you out there who are very casual people, there's 34 and a, almost 40, 35, sorry, 35,000 other people playing this. And have been playing it for the past five years. Uh, it's almost six years. 60 indie puzzle game, blah. Interesting but bloated. It's okay. You will get what you pay for. I highly recommend it to anyone who frequently plays puzzle games, says Fairy241. Loves it. The best football says it's awesome. Gave it 88%. Wow. That's a hell of a review. That's one hell of a review. So, Tiddlist, Tidalist, Tiddler, Tiddalis, £3.99. So all in all, if I'm going off Green Man Gaming price, I've probably got about 50 quid's worth of games so far. So I've not done too badly. If I'm going by G2A, maybe 20 quid's worth of games. So still not too bad for 6 quid. I'm happy with that. What is Return Null? Right, this is our fifth and final game in our five key downloads. Ah, £2.79. Blah. Oh, I was hoping for another £30. That would have been awesome. Awesome! Right, so this looks like a story-based game, comic style. In a, let's have a quick look. Uh, first in a three-part point-and-click adventure, blah, oh my god. This was released last year by Digital Tribe Games, uh, developed by Michael Luckgen. Luckgen. Yes! Right, so the reviews. This guy gave it 80%, Assassin 1. A Cassin, a Cassassin one gave it eighty percent. He must have liked it. The only problem, the only problem in this game, is that the characters aren't voiced, which makes me sad because it's a great game. Oh, poor a Cassassin, still gave it eighty percent. So he obviously really enjoyed it. Thank you for your review. All right, so Legolas Catan says. 45% a low price, okay, sorry, but short little gameplay and poor art. And I bet that's exactly how he talks. For those interested in giving the game a try, the second of three episodes has been released and is available to be purchased on GMG as well. Yes, we did see that, didn't we? We saw that. Return Null Episode 2. Another £2. 
out of your your pocket. Uh, I can't get it. Uh, let's just try pasting that in there again, and we'll get. Just check out. Look, there you go. Episode two. So if you're interested in this game, look, you can grab two episodes out of three. Uh, when was episode two released? September 2015. Let's see the reviews on this one. <laughs> it's the same two guys. <laughs> Akasasin and Legolas. Very similar scores. I'm noticing stuff going on here. If you're an adventure game fan, this trilogy is well worth playing, even though it's not a trilogy yet. Yes, if you enjoyed the first episode, it'd be a good purchase. So, thank you guys for your reviews. They are awesome. I'm very impressed, actually. That's probably the first time I've ever bought one of these bundles and got some half-decent games in there. And as I reiterate in every single one of these videos, do not bother trying to claim any of these Steam keys because I've claimed a lot already. I've got them all. So I might even blur them out just to, uh, just to make it a bit easier on myself. So that is the five game bundle from Green Man Gaming. And in all honesty, much better than the three pack. So it's worth spending the extra three quid or whatever it is, two quid, to get the five pack because they're all steam keys none of them are origin or any of these other things and I got some quite good games in there bridge constructor and dark souls I think those two alone very good games so I'm happy with that let me know exactly what you think of this bundle in the comments below let me know exactly what you think of me no don't I'm only joking let me know exactly what you think of the two bundles because there's two videos if you haven't watched the three pack bundle jump back and watch it it's in it's on our channel somewhere so all I've got now to say is thank you very much for watching I appreciate you watching all the way to the end very kind of you and I will see you next time Bye.